While the brunt of the hard freeze may be over, but the work continues across our area. Plumbers, well, they say they are busier than ever repairing homes damaged by the freeze. ABC 13's Karen Alvarez shares with us the story of one family who, despite taking precautions, was still impacted. Karen. Hello, yeah, the plumbers that I talked to say this year they haven't seen as extensive damages compared to last year's freeze. They say people were more prepared uh, this time around, but still Mother Nature got the best of some homes. Video shared to ABC 13 by Almeda Plumbing shows the extensive damage caused to one Conroe home thanks to a broken pipe in the attic. The pipe ruining part of the carpet and flooring while water drips from the ceiling. Ever since the hard freeze moved in on Thursday, plumbers have been hard at work answering calls from clients who need help. Sometimes it's heartbreaking because the people work really hard for their homes and you get there and their homes is completely destroyed. So you feel bad and all you can do is just try to help them as much as you can and try to get the job done as fast as possible. And in just the last couple of days, Almeida says he's witnessed his share of damages caused by the freeze, some less severe than others. People People not uh, insulating their pipes, people just not being careful, they're not letting their water drip, just the normal stuff. ABC 13 followed Almeda Plumbing to one of their service here. calls today, a home in Spring, Texas. We watched as technicians worked to repair a broken pipe. It left the homeowners without water over the holiday weekend. It was, uh, what, Thursday late. Uh, we mm -hmm. decided to, you know, undo everything try to get the uh, the water going back and everything we turned it off and and uh, noticed you know, there were some leaks and everything we have to go inside the wall cut the sheetrock and repair the pipe thankfully this tear didn't cause a lot of damage and the plumbers were able to fix the pipe so that the homeowners could have running water again but back in february of 2021 it was a different scenario for these homeowners uh, we had a whole almost t entire first floor the last freeze get devastated with about three inches of water. So um, this one's obviously a little bit lighter, but uh, still, you know, without water for a few days and during Christmas, it hasn't been a lot of fun. And while the hard freeze may be over, experts say there's still a lot of work to be done till many of them are able to catch a break. Reporting in Houston, Karen Alvarez, ABC 13 Eyewitness News.